Cloning different mushrooms from the grocery store is one of my favorite things to do. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I cloned this king oyster mushroom so that I could save the genetics and grow it for many years to come. To ensure a clean transfer, we have to work in front of HEPA filtered air or inside of a still air box. After wiping everything down with isopropyl alcohol, I cut the mushroom in half with clean scissors and I use a sterile needle to select the tissue from inside of the mushroom and I transferred that to a nutrient agar plate. King oyster mushroom is definitely the easiest mushroom that you can clone because of the thickness of the stem. This makes it very easy to collect a clean sample. After transferring the tissue sample, the agar plate is wrapped in parafilm or saran wrap and it is incubated at around 75 degrees Fahrenheit until the mycelium has covered the agar plate. You can make additional transfers from the resulting mycelium or you can expand it to grain spawn to start cultivating. 